Hi guys, Kendall Clark here. Um, today I wanted to show you some cool tricks that you can do with the new envelope feature in Resolume Arena 6. I've got a clip running here. First let's start with something basic. Here's the bright contrast and let's say we want to modulate the opacity or in this case the brightness of this effect to come in to BPM. So first we're going to go BPM sync and we're going to minimize our maximum here to zero and change our direction and bring our beats down to two. Now we have a nice BPM synced effect with the intensity of the clip bumping um, and all synced to the clock. Now that's fine, but right now it's just limited to a linear movement between point A and point B. Um, so let's now take a look at how we can use envelopes to get a little more creative with that same idea. So here is a similar effect. Let me turn it on. You can see in the first effect I had to change the direction. In this case I like to do the inverting in the envelope. So I'm going to keep the direction of the parameter going forward, still set to BPM, two beats. And then here we can see our max value and our min value. Currently we're still set to linear, but now we can add some more points and get a little more creative with it. So I'm going to double click to add a point, drag him down, so I'm going to tighten this up. If you right click, you can add easing. So this is just like After Effects where we'll use quadratic in out. And now we have a little more control over the shape of that modulation. And then you can also see when you're in BPM mode, you get this nice grid that points will snap to. And if you add more beats, you get more slices in your grid. Now, when you add more beats at first, the automation's going to move slower, but you can use this to your advantage to create more intricate envelope shapes in here. Let's go back down, and I'll show you the example that I've already cooked up. So in this case, we have a four beat clip that pops in on beat two with a slow fade and then a quick snap on the upbeat. Um, so I'm sure you're kind of getting an idea of where I'm going here. These can be really powerful once you start adding different effects with different modulations. Uh, some other things to keep in mind are that the length of this modulation phrase is independent from the transport of the clip. Um, so you can get really creative. If you're familiar with Ableton Live, this is very similar to clip envelopes. So that's kind of a rough breakdown. Let me play through some content. So I've got just four clips. Three of them are the same clip, but have some interesting effect modulation using envelopes. So let's see what we can do with that.
Cool. So I'm going to kind of give you an idea. I was playing around with just those four clips with the mini controller, but other than that and adjusting the global speed, all of those effects were written in using the new envelopes and Arena 6. So check them out if you haven't already. They're pretty dope.